It's Jersey's other coastline. The Delaware River runs more than 400 miles all along Jersey's western border, draining a watershed that touches five states. Some areas remain pristine. Others need a little work, like the so-called Muddy Muscanet Kong in Warren County. Sections of the river got a total makeover a few years back. The result? I've seen wood turtle, I've seen mink, I've seen river otter. Officers with the Audubon Waddle Stewardship Center showed us where a coalition of environmentalists reshaped the river, added curves and boulders to help improve water quality and wildlife habitat. So what happens is the water comes around it, scours out areas, creates another deep spot, but it also keeps that water moving, keeps the riffles going, which increases the oxygen. Now we have areas all along here for about a mile that have these deeper pools, so creating that, um, that refuge for the trout. And opportunities for fishing and recreation. Now projects like this one will get a boost. Five million dollars in federal funding for the Delaware River Basin Restoration Program. There's a lot to do. We are here today this, to celebrate. For the first time in history, the Delaware River has dedicated funding for restoration projects throughout the watershed. The river is threatened by overdevelopment, habitat loss, polluted runoff, flooding, and stream erosion. We'll see the five million applied throughout the Delaware River Basin. I mean, really through New York, Pennsylvania, New Jersey, and Delaware, the, the whole space has the opportunity to take this funding and put it to work for water quality, for wildlife, and for outdoor recreation. The Delaware River supplies drinking water for more than 15 million people, and it contributes $25 billion worth in economic activity to the region. Working to keep the river clean means convincing farmers to give up buffer zones, marked here by pink flags, to keep fertilizer out of nearby streams. It means planting hillsides with acres of special, deep-rooted grasses to help prevent erosion and filter rainwater. I'm just about six feet. Add another one to me. That's how much that root system is going down. That is so important in conservation, especially with water quality. The Coalition for the Delaware River Watersheds, a network of 131 organizations that works to keep projects like these on track. Everybody benefits. What you do here goes far beyond the property the boundaries, right? So that buffer here is slowing up that sediment, filtering out pollutants, not just for this spot, that's for everybody in the whole community. Five million dollars may not seem like a lot of money, but it was a hundred thousand that helped the Musconetcong run fast and clear. Imagine what that five million will buy. In Mansfield, I'm Brenda Flanagan, NJTV News.